hello hello to all of my beautiful subscribers welcome back to my channel let's get some more messages okay this is for aquarius i had transformation and breaking point that was the first two cards out before i got really interrupted okay so it's definitely a lot of distractions going on okay it could be a lot of confusion or chaos around you okay it's a lot of stagnant energy aquarius surrounding you at this time you can have a lot of people that's trying to hold you back or keep you stuck but you're definitely going through a transformation okay can you close the room door? Close the door. Yeah, evil eye. I'm telling you. It's like when you're around these people, you don't get a sense of joy. Like you don't have, it's like all your energy is being drained and sucked from you. The more that you stay around these people, yeah. But you are getting the guidance to move away from these people. Because you've been masking your true feelings and emotions for too long around these people. You've been hiding your true self regarding these people. You see how you're trying to go towards the sun and it's like somebody's trying to hold you back. You see how they got your hand? If you can see that. Okay? You got people that's trying to block you from going towards the distance. Going towards bigger and better. Okay? It's like you're wanting to move forward, but you got these energy vampires around you draining you. Okay? And it's like nine times out of ten, you don't even know these people intentions because they're putting on a show these people is is wanting you to be fake or wanting you to mask and hide what it is that you feel or what you want to do because that's what they're doing putting on a show some of you guys can actually be a performer or actually in the industry okay some of you guys could be going to a concert all right this person been wanting to talk to you and reach out to you since of last year of thanksgiving because i seen the thanksgiving call but because of this person has so, like, so many energy vamps around him. Because this person wants to go towards the sun. You see? She's looking at the sun. She's looking out. But it's someone that's holding him or her back. Take it to resonate. This person has been getting guidance, okay? Been talking to people, okay? About you. So this person could have been having conversations with their friends or family. Close friends and family about you. Okay, fork in the road is giving me like the two of swords. So people did get their opinion or give their suggestion or whatever the case may be, or they gave their advice to this person, but it, it came with rumors, okay, because the rumors is here. Because these people could be secretly obsessed with you. That's why it's best to not talk to a lot of people about something, someone, somewhere, or anything that you have going on in your life because not people want, not everybody wants the best for you, okay? All right, let's see. Yeah, the two of cups, soon as I crack them to the deck and the night of soul, somebody rushing in fast, whether it's swift communication or they're rushing in, charging in towards you. Yeah, it could be this King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or this person just in the King of Swords energy. So when they're cutting out people, places, and things, shit that don't make sense to them, okay? I hear this person say, make it make sense. So this person definitely is talking like you, or they <laughs> or they could just three, 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 just seven o'clock, or this person is not engaging into shit that don't make sense to them, okay? So let's see what's going on, Spirit Guys, Angels, Ancestors. So we had the seven of swords. Hmm. What's this seven of swords? Ace of Pentacles. So this person, let's see. Give me one of the seven of swords. King of Cups. Yeah, I'm getting to the point to where though, because this person is so giving. This person is a very giving person. So this person got people around them that be plotting and planning and stealing from them. It could be people that's literally trying to plot and plan to rob this masculine with the seven of swords and this ace of pentacles. Because this person is the king of cups. This person is so naive or they're just like, just a very giving, caring person, male or female, take it where it resonates. And you got people strategically trying to steal from you or strategically plotting to set you up. Page of swords, two of swords. Yeah, you won't see this coming. They could have been talking about this for a while now with the page of swords. 
So who you think is with you or rocking with you isn't really with you or rocking with you. My alarm been going off in my house for a minute, okay? Every time I hit my alarm go off, it gave me confirmation that I'm on point. What's this page of swords? Like, you got people watching you from all different angles, two of swords, but you don't see this. You don't know this. You're blind to it. It's like you're pulling a blind ear, blind, whatever they say, a blind eye to the situation. That's definitely snake you out energy. Look at this shit. Five of wands and the three of pentacles. People is just, ugh, I don't fucking know. Five of wands and the three of pentacles. These people been in competition with you. They been jealous of you. They been hating on you. This is nothing new. And these are people that's in your community. People that's in your circle. Three of pentacles. I'm hearing that song about future. Keep them squares up out your circle. Five, five, five on the clock. Keep them squares up out your circle. They know that you hurt you. They know that you hurt you. I'm telling you. <clears throat> these people is plotting against you to set you up and steal all your money. Everything that you have. Because the Ace of Pentacles is everything you have. When you see the Ace of Pentacles... It's giving me like, they feel like that you are MVP. You're the most valuable player. So they feel as though, can you go back in there and go over there? It's like this part, they feel like you MVP. You're the most valuable player. So they're trying to block you, stop you, delay you, and cause you confusion. Because yeah, once again, this person is very giving. This person don't care what it is. This person is the type of person that probably take their shirt off their back if they needed to, if they wanted to, if they had to, to make sure the people in their community or people that's in their social group is secure. Give me one second. Okay. But the whole time these people was in competition with you, they're jealous and envious of you. That's why the evil eyes out here. And you've been getting guidance to move away from these people, places, and things. You're still not listening to Christ. Like, these people looking at you with the page of swords, like, they don't know. They will never catch on. They will never find out or figure out that we're slowly but surely stealing from this person. Like, they really are looking at you as you're naive. You're gullible. You're sweet or something. But this person, the energy I'm picking up off this masculine, or this could be a fem feminine, nothing about you is sweet. Point blank, period. So you can have people sitting up here trying to strategically plot and plan on you. Okay? Somebody literally could have got jumped and robbed. It was a setup. It was an inside job with the Three of Pentacles. So if you recently just got robbed or set up or jumped or whatever, it's because somebody in your circle with the story of pentacles told them. This person been a snake, seven of swords, two of swords, and this person been watching you the whole time. They had their eyes on you the whole time, just waiting for the perfect time. Give me more on this page of swords and this two of swords. Yeah, the three of wands in reverse. So if you were just in a jam, it's because it was an inside job. Or oh, this is about to happen. Take it where it resonates. And it's going to be because of the people in your community or the people in your circle. I just keep saying circle because this is people in your circle, man. This is ridiculous. What's this three of one? Yeah, five of cups. You're going to be feeling... You're going to be... Oh, baby. Get the fuck away from these people, yeah. Yeah, there's no love in this game. I'm telling you. There's no love in this game. There's no love with these people. You can't trust these people. You need to get the fuck away from these people. They don't even fuck with you. Yeah, there's no love in this game. Everybody is out to get each other. Okay? It's like eat or be eight is what I heard. And they trying to eat your ass alive. But you keep being around these people again because you're the king of pentacles for real. 
They know who the fuck you is. They know your status. They just been waiting to pull this lick on you. I'm 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 not even about to hold my tongue because this is some real life shit right now. This energy that I'm picking up on, like you ain't gotta believe me. And it could be because of the person that you actually married to or committed to. Go over that way. Because I'm recording. The phone is right here. You just have to wait a second. What's this three of wands? Yeah, look. Six of swords. You have to move away from these people. Because it's coming. They just waiting on the right time. They're trying to catch you when you're not paying attention. They're trying to catch you off guard with the two of swords. Three of wands in reverse. What's this three of wands in reverse? Ten of... I was about to say ten of family. So it could be your family. With the ten of cups and the magician. This is your family doing this shit to you. This is your family, bruh. They been jealous of you. They been envious of you. They have been trying to stake, snake you out and steal from you. Everything that you have. Ace of Pentacles. Because you're the king of pentacles. And the only reason why these people want to stay attached to you because you're the only one that's providing and, and willing to give everything to these people. Family and friends. Three of pentacles, ten of cups. These motherfuckers ain't fucking with you. I'ma just keep it real. They're not. There's no love out here. Only thing that's probably love is the ten of cups and that ain't even that. Okay, your family is some snakes. Or they are. The fuck? Yeah, the will of fortune in reverse. Like, it's just everything is spiraling downhill for you at this point. Everything is gone bad. It's because these people is trying to set you all the way the fuck back. Will of fortune in reverse. They don't want you to go forward. They don't want good things to happen for you. They want you to be in poverty. They want you to be fucked up, fucked over, and ass the fuck out. Okay, we just got to keep it real here. Like, no bullshit. What's this ten of cups in the... It's the magician called. <clears throat> Just give me a second, Zayden, okay? Because I really need to get this message out. Just give me a second, okay? So, let's see. What's this Ten of Cups and the Magician? Five of Pentacles. I just said this. They want you to be assed up and assed out. They don't want you to have nothing. How the fuck you go from the Ace of Pentacles? Excuse me if I'm cursing too much, okay? I'm trying to switch my language up. But when I started to speak some real shit, that, that language just come out of me, okay? I got different languages, okay? And I speak all of them. I'm bilingual. Anyway, with this Ace of Pentacles, how is you going... How are you the Ace of Pentacles? And then once this happens, you're going down to the Five of Pentacles. You drop down to the Five of Pentacles. They are trying to take everything from you. And they don't care what it is, how they got to do it, or why they got to do it. And they can send people that's in your circle, your closest friends, your closest mans, your family. I'm hearing that song, Mask Off, Fucking Mask Off. You about to really see who these people are. Whether if you want to believe it or not. Yes, yeah, seven of wands, you need to protect yourself and stand your ground against these people. And right behind that, I seen the ten of swords. Ten of swords just popped out and they disappeared. So... Somebody's about to get betrayed by family and friends. And you'd be surprised who these people, places, and things are, man. I'm telling you. They want you to be ass the fuck out. They don't want you to have shit or nothing. Clarify more on this magician card. These people been orchestrating this shit in the background for the longest behind your back. What's the magician called? Because they just feel like you just so... Blind to it. Look, we got the devil and the fool. They're just waiting. What's this fool card? Let me see. Come on, so you can go in there. Here you go. Because you just be downloading games and you don't even be playing them. What's the, the devil card? Yeah, they, they feel like you a fool. They feel like you sweet. I'm telling you, they, they calling you sweetness off of rollbouts. I'm hearing that song, sweetness. They is playing with you, okay? 
Yeah, because they're trying to confuse you and have you all over the place to not walk away. Because they're trying to get this done before you do walk away, before you actually get out of their presence. These people is all up in your energy for money, Ace of Pentacles. Because they could be doing bad or they could be going out bad, sad, or whatever the case may be. And their whole thing is to set you up, to probably rob you and take you for everything that you have. And it's just something just keep drawing me to this attention to people in your circle, man. They smile in your face, but whole time, their, their whole main goal is to betray you. It's to double cross you, two of swords. And they think that you sweet. Like, it's time for you to pay attention here. That's why the page of swords here. You have to pay attention. Take the blindfolders off and see these people, places, and things for who the fuck they is and who the fuck they're not. Because it's a setup right here. It's a setup about to happen. And they, they, they want you to be all over the place. They want you to be unsure about walking away and fully detaching from them. Family and friends. Because they're taking you for everything that you have right up under your nose, whether you want to believe it or not. <clears throat> What's this devil card, Spirit? Yeah, you're not listening. You you ignoring shit. Full cuts. Stop being stubborn. You like, you brushing it off. You like, uh-huh, whatever. Can't nobody tell me nothing. Uh-uh, you can't tell me nothing. Uh-uh, you can't tell me nothing. Wait till I get my money, right? That's what I'm saying. You you so focused on the money, you chasing after the money. That's what they see. They see you as a fucking they see you as a as the bag, okay? What is this devil card? Like, you really need to take the blindfolders off and see these people for what they is. Because these people is in competition with you. Shh. Five of wands. Plotting and planning to set you up. Go against you. Mm -mm -mm. What's this devil card? Son, wait a second. No. What's the devil card? Six of Pentacles. Because you give to these people. You... you you take care of these people. These people know that you're very much giving. Can you move your head? It's in the camera. These people know that you're giving. These people know that you're kind-hearted. That you would do any and everything. You so quick to run to these people's rescue. Is they running to your rescue if some shit was to pop off or to shake or to go down? No, they're not. Because they're going to turn their fucking back on you and disappear. Act like ain't shit happened once some shit pop off. Yeah, you're going to really see these people for who they is because they've been living in lies and shit. They've been deceiving you since deceiving you. I'm telling you, look, they're secretly trying to end you out here. Like somebody could have recently got robbed or this is going to happen. Like, I'm just, I just need to let you know. And you ain't got to listen to me. But it's out here. It's right here. There's some secrets heading in the game with this shit. And there's people in your community. It's your intermediate circle. It's, it could be up to three people, five people, your family, like 10 people. Like, you never fucking know. These motherfuckers could have signed the contract behind your back. Your family could have did this behind your back to take everything. I'm hearing something about an estate, Okay. So something about a state, I'm going to leave the moon card in the death. Oh. That's just fucking crazy. People just wicked as shit out here. That's why it's best to, like, make sure that you really trust these people that you say that you hanging with. Because nine times out of ten, the same motherfuckers that you hanging with, you partying with, you think that's your friends, you think that's your family, they really jealous and envious of you. They really trying to snake you out. Yeah. Shh. My son talking about some, yeah. Like, they really trying to, like, go against you here. 
Mm -hmm. Like, cause they think you sweet. This food card is giving me it's like sweet. Shush, shush. This food card is giving me like sweetness. Can you get up and go in there if you gonna get to talking? Thank you. So you got a lot of people that's trying to cause distractions, man. You, this is what. Okay, this is why I keep picking up on the distractions. Because you're gonna get so. <laughs> And they think it's funny. You see that shit? Like, these are messages. You have to pay attention. They whole time laughing and smiling and shit. Because they, they, bruh, I ain't about to keep saying the same shit. Yeah, nine of swords. It's not to be scared. It's not to be fearful. It's not to be paranoid. It's not to be sitting up here walking around, watching your back, making sure ain't nobody out to get you. But it's best to just remove yourself or go into hermit mode for a while. And you will be revealed to you. Shh. Who these snakes is that's around you. Because they're really trying to set you up, bro. The seven of swords and the ace of pentacles was the first two cards that came out of here. You cannot tell me, as a tarot reader, this is not a setup for a big-ass large sum of money. Whether you orchestrating it or somebody else orchestrating it. But something and something, somewhere, somebody is orchestrating some snake shit behind your back to, but to double-cross you. These people been fake. These people been too faced. You're so focused about losing. You're losing sleep and stressed out about this empress because you feel like it's over with the world card and that you really need to reach out and talk to this empress. Maybe you do. Stop being stubborn and reach out and talk to your divine feminine. Your divine feminine probably could have already told you these things time and time again about these people, places, and things in your energy. You're just not listening. You're listening to everybody else that's real life two time in your ass. Instead of actually listening to somebody that actually knows what the fuck they're talking about. These people's only telling you what you want to hear because they're laughing at your ass behind your back because they know that you are a fucking fool. Come on, man. Wake up. Wake up. Smell the coffee. And Spirit say that's the truth. Ace of Swords. Wake up. Look, you're, you're, you're awakening now. Look. See the truth for what it is. It stop fucking sleeping out here. Because, man, what's the devil called, Spirit? Ace of Swords and guidance. Again, I'm telling you, your ancestors and your spirit guides is around you at all times protecting you. They're guiding you. They're giving you the truth. They're speaking the truth to you. And all these, like, this how you know that you have guidance around you. This is how you know. When spirit bring random ass people towards you. And it don't have nothing to do with what you got going on. But you got to listen to the message that's being relayed at that time when spirit is bringing these people to you. Because whether you want to hear it, listen, or believe it or not, it's a message for a message every fucking where. 23, 23. People don't want to listen to that shit, though. People think that they got to keep running to their friends and family and listening to what they got to say. Half of the time, these friends and family don't got no guidance of their own. So how the fuck can you let them lead you somewhere? Where they're leading you is to your own fucking demise. That's where they're leading you. And then they're going to get away with it because it's going to be so discreetly hidden that it's no trace, bro. I, I'm not about to keep dropping gems on y'all. I'm not about to keep hipping y'all to the game. But everybody think they know the street life. Everybody think they so fucking street smart. How the fuck are you street smart if you sitting up here getting caught up, getting finessed, getting robbed, getting bagged? What? But everybody's so quick to want to be street smart. That's why I always told myself when I used to talk to people, I'm book and street smart. Because if you are actually book smart, it, it don't it, all it takes is fucking common sense to figure out how the way people move in the streets and operate. 24-24. Because nine times out of ten, the shit that you read or that you learn or that you discover is just a correlation of what the fuck goes on in the reality, in the real world. It's just worded or said or put, or put differently. You feel me? Like, make shit make sense here, y'all. And it's like everything that you read, everything that you hear, everything that you learn, you have to be willing to crack the code yourself. 
That's why motherfuckers is sleep out here. You can't even crack the code, so what makes you think you can move and operate in life the way that you do? You're just another fucking fool that's in the way. You're just in the fucking way. All fools get left, I'm telling you. Why you think so many motherfuckers just, just do shit out of risk? Like, it's it's one thing to, 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 to have faith and do shit, okay? But... As long as you know, once you do it, you know where your ass at. Half of the time, people do shit and don't even know where they ass at. That's what I'm saying. Like, stop playing out here, man. Just stop. Because when people see that you, when people see that you're not paying attention, like, you can tell a motherfucker that's sweet when you first get around him. I'm telling you. You can read when a person is sweet as shit. I'm not about to sit up here. Can't nobody sit up here and tell me that you cannot tell when somebody is sweet. You cannot tell me when somebody is green. You cannot tell me you can walk up to somebody and you cannot tell me that they sweet. Now, don't get me wrong. Looks can be deceiving, though. Looks can be deceiving. It really can. That's why I said whoever this person is, this, this, this king of cups, could be a Capricorn, could be a Pisces, a Scorpio. Okay? Whoever this person is, this person is always giving and doing for people in their community, people in their family. This person is a good person, okay? But what they are failing to realize and what they're failing to miss to see is these people is trying to set this masculine up. It's really this person's family, whether they want to believe it or not. Because this family been jealous of this masculine. When you have energy vampires, you have energy vampires in your life through your family, through your friends. But you have to be willing to pay attention and take the rose-colored glasses off and discover these foes that's in your energy. These foes that's in your family. These foes that's in your life. That's why it's best for people to stay in isolation. Because when you stay to yourself and you stay by yourself and you're in harmony mode, you can peek out the fucking front. Like, you can peek out the people that's trying to be against you. You have to wait. It's not cutting on. Zayn, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get up. Go in there, cause I cannot hear. Nah, get up. Okay, it's a whole nother room in here. I'm so sorry, y'all, but I don't like when I'm talking and I get interrupted. That's one thing I don't like. Disrespect. These motherfuckers is disrespecting you. Point blank, period. That's what the fuck is going on. That's what the fuck it is. Like. They real, I think you sweet out here. I just can't stop saying the same thing. But like I was saying, though, Zoe, stop. But like I was saying, that's why it's best to be in hermit mode and isolation and to yourself because you would know who's really against you and who's with you. It's not that hard for you to pay attention and see that because it'll be shown to you. You have to be willing to accept these people for who they are once they're shown their true colors to you because you're being shown these people true colors but you're still not listening you're still not wanting to believe it you're still not wanting to see it you're still not wanting to hear it and then it's like now spirit gotta put throw something in the mix for you to see that these motherfuckers was never fucking with you from the jump why should spirit have to do that to make you get the fuck away from these people. Like, come on now. What's the devil called? My legs going to sleep. My foot going to sleep. Okay. Woo, y'all. My foot is going to sleep. What's the devil called? Eight of swords. I'm telling you. They're trying to keep you stuck. They're, they setting a trap for you. This is a trap. They're setting a trap for you. They're setting a major trap. What's this eight of, eight, eight of swoop? The hermit. I just said going into hermit mode. Like you got to be willing to listen. Whatever messages you're receiving, whatever you're seeing with your third eye, whatever you're hearing, believe it. Believe it. Damn, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm over here stretching and shit. But you got to believe that shit, man. 
Stop letting these motherfuckers play you as a fool and look at you like you sweet because ain't nothing sweet about you. Damn, look, you're the emperor. You're a boss. I'm telling you. We're getting wrong, side <laughs> But you're a boss. Like, stop playing. Tell them, yeah, stop playing with you. Real life shit because they playing with you. Look, confirmation again. I told y'all, every time I say some real shit, the alarm in my house go off. That spirit telling y'all that this is confirmation all the way. The Ace of Swords came out twice. They're trying to set a trap for you. But if you disappear on their ass, go incognito, go into Hermit mode, and listen to your own guidance, 30, 30, 30, 31. Okay? And let spirit show you and reveal to you whether it's in your dream, whether it's through almost a... Um, you could have had a dream about a near-death experience. This might be confirmation right here. So if you had a dream of a near-death experience, this is why. Aquarius. Again, it could be because of lover. They're fucking losing everything. They're losing their home. They're losing their stability. That's why I say you got to be careful. This shit is crazy. Please do not force the messages if it doesn't resonate. But this is somebody's message, okay? This is a masculine that needs to hear this and needs to clearly pay attention and listen. Because their ancestors and guides is all around them. Giving them messages. It could be through birds. It could be through synchronicities of numbers. It could be through feathers. It could be through this person's dream. It could be through other people. You got to pay attention to the conversations you be having with other people too. That's why I say spirit be doing shit and, 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 like in all different kind of ways. It could come to you in all kind of ways. Guidance. And the truth can come to you in every form, every which way. You just got to be willing to pay attention. Yeah, now we got the Queen of Cups popping out. Okay, so this could be someone that you're in love with. Let's see. Who's this Queen of Cups? Yeah, someone that you look up to. Someone that gives you good advice is what I'm getting. What are you trying to do? It's messed up, Zoe. Give me my tablet. I have to put it on the charger. Come on now. Look, I ain't going to keep telling you now. Anyway, y'all, I'm so sorry. Please excuse me. Yeah, that's the truth. Ace of Swords. Let me hurry up y'all message, Aquarius. 32, 33. This person looks up to you. This person takes your advice. This person feels as though you have good advice. And this person know that by... Taking your advice is the best thing for them to do. Because if they don't, I'm telling you, this person already had a dream of a near-death experience. And this is just confirmation. Ace of Swords. What's the death in the moon card? What's the death in the moon card? This person had a dream that they died or some shit. Yeah, nine of swords, and this person is afraid. They're frightened. They're scared. They're paranoid. Ace of swords again at the bottom of the deck, and I just shuffled. I'm telling you, five of swords, ten of swords, three of swords, in reverse. Okay? The five of swords and the ten of swords, these people is really, really, really plotting and planning on your demise. They're trying to end you. Literally. Okay? These people are trying to hit you where it hurts. And they feel as though and they feel as though by taking you for everything is going to be the best way to go. Give me one second, y'all. It's a lot of distractions going on, y'all. 
It's like people don't want you to know that this is what they're doing behind your back. They're trying to set you up. I don't know if it's to set you up to have you go to jail or set you up to really kill you, sacrifice you, or whatever the case may be. Oh, Lord. What is this five of swords and this ten of swords? What's this five of swords and ten of swords? Seven of wands. Yeah, you got to protect yourself. What's this five of swords and the ten of swords? Two of wands. You have to clearly decide and choose and make a decision on where you're going next, okay? Because staying around these group of people, friends, and family members is not the is not the right way to go. What's this two of wands? Yeah, you just keep popping up as the king of pentacles, I'm telling you. And you could be very discreet or moving in silence right now because you don't want people to know that you got money, but they know, Okay? You got a rat somewhere in your circle. I'm telling you, I cannot fucking make this shit up. Whoever you're talking and telling your business to or conversing with, stop telling them shit. Stop talking to their ass because you got a rat in your circle. Point blank, period. And they're going back and dropping all that same shit you gave to these motherfuckers. Like these people. Who? Oh, let me slow down because I'm about to start channeling. These two people told this person to go do their homework on you. So this person got closer to you. You'd be surprised the closest motherfucker to you is the same one that's envious, jealous of you, and trying to snake you out. Confirmation again. What's the two of wands? Two of cups fell over here with this queen of cups, nine of pentacles, seven of pentacles. So you really want to be with this person. Okay, it could be a water sign or an earth sign. You really want to be with this person. Okay, you see yourself in a relationship with this person. You've been doing a lot of thinking, a lot of contemplating. Okay, you've been doing a lot of reevaluating about being in a relationship with this person. What's this two of wands? Temperance in reverse. Four of cups. The temperance in reverse is giving me like no seal of protection. Like, you have no seal of protection because you keep being around these people. Like, shit is unbalanced. And because you're so stubborn or you're just so stuck in your ways or you just don't want to hear what the fuck people got to say, it's just like, that's what's making your seal of protection go down. What's this tempers in reverse? Tempers in reverse, spirit guides. Yeah, the sun. Okay. They're trying to illuminate that to you. That you really need to up up the protection. Okay. But you're not going to be able to get protection around these people. Because you can't say today, oh, I'm going to stop fucking with these people. I'm not going to be around these people. I'm leaving these people in the past and I'm leaving these people behind. And then turn around a, a day or two later or some weeks later, you go right back to these same motherfuckers. That's what I'm trying to get you to understand here. Because you knew these people for a long time. This three of swords of reverse keeps coming out. You knew these people for a very long time. These people have been strategically and methodically trying to figure out how they can do this. That's why I said, like, your seal of protection is, is you don't have any because you don't want to listen. You don't want to take anybody else's advice, opinion, or what it is they have to say. So it's like you got to learn the hard way is what I'm getting. What's the sun called? Yeah, the Knight of Wands. Like, you could be so ego-based. That's what it is. You're so into your ego. So, I could be talking to a Leo, a Pisces, a Scorpio, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Air Sign. But the truth is out here. The truth is here. Everything I'm saying is the truth. Confirmation again, bro. And your ancestors, is, is they're trying to protect you, but you're, you just got to listen, okay? 
What's this Ace of Swords before I go? It's 40 minutes. God damn. Knight of Pentacles. Mm. What's this Knight of Pentacles? The Five of Cups. I'm telling you. It's going to come in like... These people going to have this shit so well thought out. So so well planned out. It's going to be so organized and orchestrated that you're going to feel like it was set up by somebody else. No, it was set up by the motherfuckers in your circle, in your family. And I'm not going to keep saying the same shit, Aquarius. Skeletons. Secrets are about to be revealed. Yeah. You sitting up here re chilling, relaxing. Let's get one more message. Yeah, it's a tarot reader. So, like, listen to this tarot reader. They're telling you something. These people is getting tarot readers on you. They know that you about to have a lot. Yeah, caught up. These people getting caught up for their shit. Look, but these people are under judgment. You see judgment on this tarot reading? Yeah, see a different perspective here. Missing piece of the puzzle. Go into hermit mode. So you can get the truth and clarity that you need. All right, Aquarius, I'm out. Make sure you guys like, share, comment, as well as subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit that bell notification. Peace.